I think this has to be talked about, everyone. So, everyone's seen The Haunted Hour. You most likely saw it. Haunted Hour, they don't pull punches. I guess the real reason is because I think it's based on R.L. Stein's narratives. And they just run free with it. Which, I think they stay very close to it. But on the other hand, who knows? I mean, there are narratives. There's no way, shape, or form we even ever will know what Lily D was truly capable of or is the fact of we actually know what Lily D is capable of and that's exactly what the narrative says she does so the interesting part would be this is what if freaking goosebumps was actually done the way our that haunted hour was just the fact of they don't pull punches and when it comes to the whole Mr. Wood choking a dog, they actually allow Mr. Wood to choke a dog. <laughs> Mr. Wood choke a dog, you allow freaking Slappy to beat the sh not a girl, punch her in the chest, beat the crap out of the freaking doll, hurl at everyone. It's most likely, yeah, freaking Haunted Hour would not, uh, Haunted Hour never actually pull punches from things. So I would say chances are, I guess, when it came to whoever filmed Goosebumps versus whoever filmed The Haunting Hour. The fact that there's different people who did it, and there's some who actually were like, yeah, we're going to keep that in episode, or we're going to lower that episode down. In The Haunting Hour, you actually will see that in one episode, I think it was called Scarecrow or something like that, you actually will see that there was actually, they were split on which episode, which ending sorry which ending they would choose because they had the ending where it was a happy ending and the ending where it was like it's up in the air but you know for the fact the freaking dead guy is dead so i would kind of like to see how goosebumps will be done today and one thing i would say is if they somehow was able to get new episodes of goosebumps i would tell them please do the ones that never was done Beast of the East, Chicken Chicken, the Abominable Snowman of Pasadena, which is like he was in the freaking movie. You definitely couldn't freaking skip that guy. Wherever the freaking haunted car coming from, you have to definitely do that one. Sadly, Parking Ghost was already done, so I guess maybe do the freaking first um, Night of the Living Dummy if you're not a wuss. <laughs> yeah, it's like if you're not a wuss, do that. But yeah, many of the episodes, many of the books were turned into episodes. It's just that somewhere they didn't actually do it for some reason. Like for instance, Deep Trouble, the first book. They actually, turns out, they actually put the second book and called it Deep Trouble, which is like, ooh, you jerk bags. Ooh, how could you? So the first Deep Trouble book wasn't actually put into an episode form. Isn't that a shocker or what? And also since technically Monster Blood wasn't really done good, so I guess you could actually just say, screw it, Monster Blood gets thrown in again. You have to redo Monster Blood, and you have to re I guess technically you need to redo the Night of the Living Dummies because they did those. So yeah, you have to redo that. You just have to redo Monster Blood and then do 2, 3, and maybe 4 because 4 is not really continuity. And uh, what are ones that they didn't do? I don't even want to pull up and say, oh, here's all the books they ever done. Um, Top of my head. I think that's mostly, I think there's some that they definitely didn't do. Because, come on, they have 47 episodes. I found that some of the episodes were actually from Goosebumps 2000. Or, heck, even Give Yourself Goosebumps. So, they weren't actually in the part of where they were like, yeah, all 47 you see, even though some were two-parters, they were basically definitely just nothing but, yeah, you know. But I will say a recommendation. A recommendation is to actually do, is to do Goosebumps Horrorland. Make that a mini-series. And just go to every single book and straight up just boom, 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 boom. So... It would most likely have to be an hour TV show. I know lots of people would be like, oh my gosh, no, no. But yeah, give 30 minutes on each of them. Well, actually, it would be less than 30 minutes. But still, give a decent amount for both of the stories. 
technically there was another story, but a the people actually watched the reviews. They never actually talked about that last part, which I guess technically was just stuff of maps and stuff like that. So filler stuff. But still, it would be kind of cool if you actually would just do that. <laughs> that would be kind of cool. That would be a cool thing. So it's like, it's kind of like a short story, but not really. Or technically like skits, you know how it is with regular show. So you have two episodes in one. Same deal. I would love to see how that comes out. And of course, why not do Goosebumps Morphs Wanted? Personally for me, if we do get a new Goosebumps series because, well, Haunted Hour got canceled. That's just sad. But if we get a new Goosebumps series, I would just say, please do the odd ones. Do the ones that you haven't done yet. That wasn't really done yet. And then after you do all those, and you're like, we're going to do all the original 62, then I'm like, yeah, do the original ones that were already done in the series. And there you go. That would be awesome. But anyways, I'm done. Thank you for watching, and have a great day. And tell me what you guys think about all this.